welcome back to the vlog happy thursday so i am currently in the car and i'm about to head to my in-person classes so i thought i would take you guys along and just show you guys like a day in a life of a business marketing student yeah without further ado if you're excited make sure to subscribe drop a big thumbs up on this video and yeah let's get going guys so i just finished class it's like literally freezing outside but i'm about to go to my next class it's like back to back so i have to like hurry because otherwise i'm gonna be late but yeah i'll see you guys there i've seen a lot of change been through a lot of pain some things are not the same as they were a year ago but all will be okay i move on each and every day the past is where it stays way back okay guys so i just finished class and i'm literally walking and it's so cold it's like so windy and i did not dress well for this today but i'm about to go to highland bakery and eat with my friend and meet her for lunch so yeah we're both starving so let's go okay so we're at lunch now um here's my friend hannah Hi. You want to tell them what we got? It is a fried chicken sandwich with pimento cheese and tomatoes on a jalapeno bread. Super delicious. So we're going to eat and then I'll talk to you guys later. Hey guys. So I just got home and I obviously showered. So I'm like in a new pair of clothes. I'm in like this cute little crew neck that my friend Olivia made for me. But I am about to actually do some work. Literally, it's so gloomy and just like rainy and windy outside. The rain has stopped now but you know what i mean not gonna lie to you guys all i want to do is just sit and watch a movie and just like have a lazy day but i have stuff to do so i'm gonna make my to-do list really fast and then i'm gonna get on to it because you know i don't want to be working over the weekend so i might as well just get the work done now So my calendar is kind of out of order, but I made my to-do list. Basically, I have to do this reflection and quiz, which is like kind of a writing assignment. And then I have to do this Amazon campaign. So if you guys didn't know, and you've been watching my vlogs for a while, then you know that I worked with Lead Abroad for a little bit. I was interning with them for a little while, but the internship ended. Um, but now I'm doing a campaign with Campus Trends Letters. And basically, I got this campaign to work with Amazon, which is awesome because I use Amazon all the time so this is so funny that i'm talking about this because i was literally looking at the window and i was getting distracted and i was like why did like amazon just like drive up my driveway but i forgot that i ordered this little lamp from amazon and i'll show you guys in a few but yeah i have to do that and then i'm gonna edit a video for creator now so i haven't really updated you guys and i've been a little bit quiet about you know where i am at life and like how my life is going and like if i've had any new opportunities and stuff and so i guess now's the good time to update you guys since like i'm telling you guys all this stuff but creator now is a program for youtubers or aspiring youtubers and creators and it helps you to enhance your content helps you to build a great community of creators and the whole thing was started by this youtuber named eric decker i don't know i never planned to join even though i thought it was a cool program but a while back in december i saw this scholarship opportunity and so i applied and then i ended up getting the scholarships so that was super cool and so now i'm in creator now and i love creating and making youtube videos and i'm always looking to improve my content so that is what i'm doing now and then the last thing on my list is oh my gosh i didn't even spell it right <laughs> it's finance ps4 which means practice session four so yeah i'm gonna stop talking to you guys now and i'm gonna stop procrastinating and actually get to doing the work <music> So 
it's currently 6 41 now and i actually finished one of my assignments i actually started with finance but then i didn't know how to do the finance so i decided to do this writing assignment instead and this first assignment is a demarketing reflection but essentially what demarketing is is when a company tries to convince a consumer to use their product instead and avoid the use of other products in order to benefit a global reason. I actually didn't know what this meant before I looked it up and one of my friends explained it to me. <laughs> Shout out to Pam for explaining it to me because I was just lost. But I'm going to tell you guys the example that I came up with because the point of this vlog is to kind of educate and inform you guys what it's like being a business major and I feel like I like watching college vlogs because I like to see what other students, you know, pursuing their career is like. That way it gives me a general idea of whether I should pursue that degree. But anyways, I'm going to get back on track. The example that I gave was how I went to the store one day and and me and my mom always carry out water cases but then that one day there was a cart and the employees were trying to advertise their new water filter and so the water filter was a very expensive investment and you know that could drive people away from buying the water filter and they would just spend you know on the water cases like me and my mom do but then as we heard the benefits of the water filter we decided to invest in the water filter because in the long run it saves you money but it also helps the environment and so that means it drives down the production of plastic water bottles so that's an example of demarketing anyways i finished the assignment and silly me i wrote about like 600 words but then i looked at the rubric and it turns out the assignment's supposed to be under 250 words so literally i've just been sitting here trying to cut down my story and my explanation of my assignment but yeah um that's what i've been up to but yeah i think i'm gonna take a little break now at least i got one of the things done even though i didn't understand how to do my finance homework now i'm gonna go down and i'm actually going to eat dinner really fast and then i'm gonna head back upstairs and i'm actually going to go to a creator now meeting but yeah we'll see where the night takes us. guys so i finished dinner and i finished the creator now workshop that one was so so informative and honestly like i love having the workshops it's just amazing getting to learn from the top creators today we had adam hadi speak and it was amazing he was from current and he was talking to us about partnerships and just like how to obtain them how to get them as a small creator how to approach them and it was just so informative he actually told us the story of how i Mr. Beast. If you watch a lot of YouTube, you know who he is, but he's a really big creator on the YouTube platform and how like he got his first partnership with Current, which was so cool. But yeah, so it's currently like 9.41 right now and I'm about to work on my Amazon campaign because that's due tomorrow. So I have to create three story slides and just like show off my Amazon storefront. Okay, so a little bit about what I'm doing. Um, this campaign is with Campus Trends Letter. So like if you guys are like interested interested in micro influencing or like you have a following and you want to like do paid brand deals this is my first one but i thought i would share with you guys you sign up for their email so this is the name and so like they'll have some you know campaigns throughout the semester and then if you're a college student then you'll definitely be able to do them if you get accepted after you apply so what i'm going to do is i am going to actually you know put in some of these informations into the slide this is like one of my slides for my content but i'm going to keep going and then i'll finish and so yeah let's get to it okay guys so i've been working for like the past hour or so and um it's 10 57 right now but i've just been listening to music <laughs> comment down below what kind of music you listen to but um i finally submitted my amazon campaign stuff i would show you guys the content but if you want to see it later in the future follow me on instagram jenna underscore trong but um i can't show you guys yet because this is like unreleased stuff so yeah, I got that done. All right, so that leaves me like two things left. I'm gonna call it a night and I'm gonna go to bed because I'm super tired, so yeah. 
see you guys tomorrow hey guys quick interruption because i wanted to say that this is a collab with jesse and jesse is one of my friends and she also has a lifestyle vlog channel and her content's so cute so if you want to make sure to go check her out i'll link her down in the description but yeah um let's get back to the video hey guys good morning it is friday so happy friday i woke up this morning and i literally just had breakfast but i didn't vlog anything um so i'm actually currently in a creator now workshop this one is with daniel wall and he is a content creator and he's a shorts form content creator and i have a shorts channel too so i thought i'd just hop on and just learn some valuable information but i'm actually getting ready to film the valentine's day video so yeah i'm just gonna comb my hair really quick and get ready Okay, so I was about to go film the video, but then I already had my phone open and I just got ready. I thought I would film some TikToks. The fact that this is my setup just makes me crack up, so I just wanted to show you guys. Um, I am using this LED lamp and then I just have this Listerine bottle as my tripod because I don't have a phone tripod. But yeah, I'm going to film some TikToks really fast. Hey guys, so it's currently 7.34. I'm like a bad YouTuber, so I did not vlog at all today. I feel like I just like forgot and then I was just like in the moment of doing things and I literally forgot, but I finished filming the videos. It was super good. I can't wait for you guys to see the Valentine's Day videos. It's gonna be amazing. But after I finished filming the videos, I went to eat with my little cousin and then I actually went on FaceTime with my friend Pam. It was super fun to talk to her. Now I'm sitting on my laptop and I literally just read through my discussion for this monday i decided to get it done early but um someone finally posted in the group chat and so i just started off the conversation after what they wrote so she wrote a question about adidas and their marketing and their research questions and then i answered with this yeah good thing is i'm done with all my schoolwork for the weekend and i'm super happy because i actually like work really hard during the week to like get all my school stuff done so i don't have to work over the weekend and i can enjoy my weekend so now i'm actually about to go down and i'm I'm going to bake some lemon blueberry muffins because my friend Livia from the Live Sisters, she was telling me about these scones she made today and they looked so good. And I was like, I'm gonna try making the scones, but then I didn't have the certain right butter for it. So I am actually gonna make some lemon blueberry muffins and we'll see how they turn out. So it's currently like 12 24 right now at night and it's actually saturday um so i said i was gonna bake the muffins but then after i had the snack i kind of just like didn't feel like it anymore so i just like played with my little cousin and just like hung out with family so that was good and then i actually got ready for bed and i'm laying in bed but before i go to bed i always journal because i like to like pray and do my journaling right before bed because it just helps me like i don't know reflect on the day and like do a brain dump i guess so yeah i'm gonna journal for a little bit and then i'm gonna go to sleep Hi guys, happy Saturday. Um, as you saw, I went to go see Josh swim, so that was pretty cool. And now I'm at Longhorn Steakhouse, sorry about the lighting, with some of his friends and the team. We're gonna eat, so yeah. All right guys, so we finished dinner. It took forever at Longhorn, but the food was delicious. Except for like the steak. I don't know. The steak was cooked a little bit weird, but it's okay. But I'm finally home. I'm about to hop into the shower and just like get ready for bed because I'm super tired after a long day. Big, I wanna be.